It was a coincidence, really. I had terminated my my job in 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 Japan, which Kalinj um, needed a guy to teach in Japan that had good English and could teach. So he sent me there, and I stayed there some months, three months. Then I went back to Brazil. Went back there, stayed another three, went back to Brazil, stayed three more. And then things got a bit awkward because it's very difficult to live in a country where I didn't have really much time uh, either than teach and not being, it would, you know, it's very frustrating not speaking the language of the country that you're, you're, you're trying to introduce something. The explanations and the details gets lost in translation. So I got a bit fed up with that. And then a guy was um, uh, offered me to work in his gym in Birmingham. Small gym in a really, really poorly area. But that's where I started in an old church. And um, there was no re re real reason why, except for the fact that the guy said, let's go to England, because there's no one there. But there was, there was Shane Waraj. He was already here. He had Rick Young up north that was already a blue belt. Mark Walder was already a blue belt. So Jiu Jitsu was around, just not strong. And I think I helped make it stronger.